Hey everyone, welcome back to Ken's Card Corner. I wanted to share uh, my local card show pickups. Uh, I live in Virginia. I live in the, we call it the Hampton Roads area. And uh, Virginia Beach, if you've ever heard of that. And uh, every month there is a card show in Virginia Beach, Virginia. So, uh, all the raw cards, except for the two prisms, I paid a dollar a piece for. And then... Um, the two graded, I paid 10 bucks for a piece. So first up, I uh, was going through a box, and I found this Bob Feller. And I didn't know what it was, but it looked like it's autographed. And then I um, figured out it was a, when I got home, it was a 52 top, uh, 1952 Wheaties Bob Feller. Like I said, it appears to be autographed, so I'd definitely be sending this one into PSA to get it authenticated. And for a dollar... It was just too cool to pick, not pick up. Same box. There was this. Uh, it's a, turned out to be. I can't remember. It's 51 or 52 Burke Ross. Uh, so yeah. 52 of Joe. Ostrowski. Osh, Ostrowski. Hit Parade of Champions. It's technically. Uh, the set's name is Burke Ross. So. That was a dollar. Picked up this Mike Trout. I believe this is 2013. Yeah, 2013 tops Mike Trout. Uh, I mean, he just got just uh, won another MVP. So any Trouts for a dollar seem good for me. To me, anyways. Also picked up uh, this version, the Rookie of the Year 2012 version. I picked up this Manny Machado rookie for a dollar. Dansby Swanson, rookie. Bowman Chrome, first Bowman for a dollar. A Yachty Year Molina, first year Bowman for a dollar. I think he's going to the Hall of Fame. Wanted to pick that up. I picked up this Bobby Mitchell. Uh, I think it's 66 Philadelphia, I believe, is the year of it. For the Redskins, it was a dollar. A Brian Trotter rookie for a dollar of Islanders. It was a rookie, 35 bucks, but it was in a dollar box, so you didn't even really check. You just sold him to me. He's just trying to get rid of stuff. And this Heath Miller was another one. Bowman rookie card. So uh, I'm not sure if he's going to the Hall of Fame or not, but you think he's should he should if he's not already, so. Paid five dollars a piece for these two, and then it's back to dollars, dollar cards. I get well, they're they're not dollar cards, but I paid a dollar for them. And pick up this night uh, Nick Bosa, a rookie for the 49ers Prism, and a Dwayne Haskins. So I paid five bucks a piece for those. Thought I, that thought that was a good de fair deal. I mean, that's about how much these are on eBay. So paid five bucks a piece for those. Paid a dollar for this Brett Favre 92 Tops Gold. I don't have a whole lot of Brett Favre. And so I figured I'd pick this up for a dollar. Couldn't beat it. Got this, uh, I think it's 92. 92 Upper Deck. Yeah, 92 Upper Deck uh, Hologram. Ooh, you can see me. Of Michael Jordan. I don't know if be able to. There you go. Michael Jordan scoring leader. There is 93. Yeah, 92 93 upper deck. Any any of these for a dollar seem good. He also had a Gaylord 69 times Gay, Gaylord Perry for a dollar. And it looks pretty good. Um probably like a five or six maybe. I don't think it would be it's obviously not a Jim Mint 10 or anything, but it looked pretty good. For a dollar, so pick that up. He had two CC Sabathia rookies, Bowman Chrome rookie cards. Uh, these look really good. These are definitely going into PSA. Um, there's, I didn't see any scratches or dents or anything. So these are definitely going to be sent in to get graded. Also got this Bryce Harper Bowman Chrome. Even though I am uh, not a Bryce Harper fan as much. As I used to be. I never really was to begin with, but now he's with the Phillies. But 
I mean, like I said, it was another dollar card. So pick that up. And then I, I picked up this Andrew Benintendi purple rookie. It is numbered to 299. I had uh, no idea that people wanted so much for this card on eBay. But uh, like I said, I paid a dollar for it. Like I keep saying, so it's going probably going off the PSA as well. And then last raw card is this Tom Brady 2019 Elite. So I always pick up Brady's if I can for a dollar. So last two pickups I bought from the same guy. They were marked at twenty dollars a piece, but he did have price. That's the what the box said basically. I picked up this 87 Donruss Barry Bonds and a Mint 9. So now I have uh, two of his rookies. I still have 86 tops traded and a Mint 9. And a card I had been looking for for a while. Um, 1990 Bowman, King Griffey Jr. and a Jim Mint 10. Uh, I know it's weird that I say that I've been looking for it for a while. I've been. It's one of those cards that you'd think I'd... So, I have a clock from when I was a kid on my wall that is, says King Griffey Jr. And it has a spot for a card. And this is the card. Uh, the one that's in it is still in it. And it's been there ever since my parents bought it for me when I was a kid. And uh, I just, I've always liked this card. You know, I grew up looking at it basically. So, I was super excited. I would have paid 20 bucks for it to be honest. But he didn't have price box. So, I took it. I bought it. So uh, that is all my local card show pickups. I bought some boxes, like uh, ship, like storage boxes, but nobody wants to see that. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed my pickups. Let me know how you think I did on the prices. Uh, I think I did pretty good, considering most of them were dollar. Um, hit that thumbs up, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, Ken Sports Cards. Uh, I posted a photo of all this, you know, on Facebook. All that good stuff, and uh, thanks for watching. Have a good one.